Hey there, tech enthusiasts. Today I want to dive deep into a topic that's been buzzing around the tech world. Quantum computers and quantum cryptography. These aren't just sci-fi concepts anymore. They're right on the horizon, ready to revolutionize everything from data security to computational power. First, let's break down what a quantum computer actually is. Traditional computers use bits as the smallest unit of data, represented as either a zero or a one. But quantum computers use quantum bits or qubits, which can be both zero and one simultaneously thanks to a property called superposition. Imagine the computational power when you can process multiple states at once. Now let's talk about quantum triggers. Unlike classical logic gates, which perform basic operations like AND, Oregon, and NOT, quantum trigets can process information in a three-state system. This triple-state system exponentially increases the complexity and the power of quantum computations. It's like having an extra dimension in your computational arsenal. So, how does this relate to cryptography? Enter quantum cryptography, a method of securing data using the principles of quantum mechanics. One of the most promising techniques is quantum key distribution, or QKD. It uses qubits in superposition to create encryption keys that are theoretically unhackable. Here's the kicker. If anyone tries to eavesdrop on the key exchange, the system will know and alert you. It's like having a built-in security guard for your data. Now, let's get a bit more futuristic. Imagine integrating quantum triggers into quantum cryptography languages. This would allow for even more secure and complex encryption algorithms. The triple state system of quantum trigets can create encryption keys that are not only secure, but also incredibly efficient. This is a game changer for data security, especially in industries like finance and healthcare. But wait, there's more. Let's talk about mapping tetrahelix blockchains to spheres. Blockchains are already a robust method of securing transactions and data. But when you map a tetrahelix structure, a four helix configuration, onto a sphere, you get a highly efficient and secure data storage system. The spherical mapping allows for more data points and connections, making the blockchain both faster and more secure. So, what does the future hold? With quantum computers and cryptography, we're looking at a world where data is not only faster to process, but also virtually unhackable. Imagine financial transactions that are instantaneous and secure, or healthcare data that's impenetrable to cyber attacks. The possibilities are endless. As Mitchell Kaku, the renowned physicist, often says, the future is not something we enter, it's something we create. And with quantum technology, we're on the brink of creating a future that's more secure, efficient, and powerful than ever before. So stay tuned and keep your eyes on the horizon. Quantum computing and cryptography are not just the next big thing, they're the future. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to like subscribe and hit that notification bell for more tech insights. Catch you in the next video.